Ladies and gentlemen, I just want to let you know the Korean ceremony is going to start right about now. This way, this curtains are gonna open up, and the ceremony is gonna be in the room where the ceremony was earlier. So once again, we'd like everybody to please direct your attention. This way, this curtains are gonna open up, and the Korean ceremony is gonna be in that room. Right there. Okay, so we wanted to kind of explain step by step how this Pebic Korean ceremony went. So the first thing that we had to do basically, we had to show both sides of our families honor and respect by bowing to each other. So that was kind of cool because we've done that in the past. I had a difficult time <laughs> trying to stand up straight for some reason. I think it was nerves because every time I, I was like, please, I hope they're not judging me. <laughs> So apart from the bow, one way that we knew that our parents, both sides, accepted Matt and accepted me was if they took a shot of wine. <laughs> I was focusing like, come on, do it, do it, do it. They did it right away. Yeah, yeah, I was so happy, man. It felt great. <laughs> My mom doesn't drink alcohol just because of health reasons, so we thought it was real <laughs> wine. I'm a bad son because I was just looking like, oh yeah, just go ahead and drink it. Like, you get turned up, mom. And Gloria was like, wait! <laughs> Please take one full shot of your wine. disrupt everything but it was kind of a lighthearted moment because everyone was laughing anyway. Yeah. And congratulations for <laughs> Okay, so one thing that is super fun and popular about Pebic ceremonies is the tradition of throwing chestnuts and dates, which represent the amount of children that you're gonna have in the future, which was my favorite part! <laughs> I want you right now to pause the video and write in the comments how many kids you think we're gonna have. After you do it, press play and see if you got it right. Now we got six. If I would have known that, I would have just straight yeet. <laughs> so all them chestnuts up. So then my mom went up, and I'm like, Mom, you got me, yo. <laughs> And then she threw an additional tail. We're gonna have eight children! Better start now. Bye, guys. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> An 
another fun thing that me and Matt argue about is if we want a boy or a girl first. For your first child, would you guys like a son or a daughter? Daughter. A son. Daughter. A son. <laughs> and so another thing that we had to do was we had to take the date and put it in her mouth. But when she said that, I thought she meant like the whole thing in my mouth. Hey, Chloe, don't eat it yet. Just hold it in your teeth, okay? <laughs> because I was hungry. <laughs> so whoever ends up with the seed when they bite it, because I guess it's like there's two openings on the date, it goes that way or this way, gets the gender of the kid that they want. So this is what happened. Get that. We're gonna put this in Chloe's mouth. Chloe, do not eat it. Just hold it in your teeth. And then please put your hands up on her shoulders and face each other. Put your hands up on their sh her shoulders. And on both shoulders. <laughs> Ready? Go! Go, go, go. See it below too? I've got it! Congratulations! He is a son! You're gonna get me Matthew Jr. after all, baby! Hey! So the last thing I had to do was I had to give Glory a piggyback ride around the table <laughs> to show that I will love and support her and our family. Okay, so Matt, please turn around. It was a lot of noise and I didn't know what happened so I ended up piggyback riding her through the whole event. <laughs> but you did it. I would say for someone that's outside of the Korean culture and to be able to bring that into the, our ceremony was a very, very special thing. And I want to give a shout out to BDK Mint, the same people that made our custom hum, hum, humbucks. Humbucks. Yes! <laughs> yes. <laughs> The same people that made our custom humbucks, they did our pepic ceremony and it was fantastic. If you're thinking about doing one, you should sign up with them. Yeah, we're not just saying it. They're based in Philly and we actually live in Maryland, so it was like a trip to go there, but it was so fun. Jessica is so good. Her assistant, Sylvia, is also so good, as you saw in the montage. They know exactly what they're doing. They were super on time. We had time constraints. They were really good under pressure. And we purposely left some things out of the pepic ceremony just so it could be special for you. So we didn't want to spoil everything in case this is something that you want to do for your ceremony. So if the pepic ceremony is something that you want to do, definitely check out the link in the description. They can make your humbles and do the pepic ceremony and they are fantastic. We love them so much. Thanks for watching this and stay tuned for the video next week because we got the video. I cried, obviously. You guys ain't ready. Y'all ain't ready. Be there or be out of the loop. <laughs> Peace.